Alrighty. So, we're now in the depths here. Omega Elixir. It's getting darker. Everyone, listen up for signs of enemy movement. Stress relief skit. <sighs> Are you getting tired? Uh, a little bit. Yeah, things aren't the same as they used to be. Hey, Elise, can we borrow Tipo for a sec? Huh? Give Tipo a squeeze. No. Can feel better. Oh, this does feel good. Just the right amount of resistance. What the I hell? Do this all day. No, stop! I can't take any more. Ah, all the stress has drained through my fingers. I know, right? It's crazy addictive. Oh no! He's gonna get all stretched out. I feel so violated. I feel so violated. <laughs> okay. Uh, this thing looks tough. Look at it. It's fucking glowing with electricity. It's probably a boss. It seems to be the source of the miasma. Well, hey, we got company and it's a scary kind. Look at this fucker. Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. What's it doing down here? Isn't that one of those? Save the questions for later. A wall of wind won't last much longer. Yes, a giant demon beast. All right, here we go. Wanna rush out, everyone? It looks way tougher than the others. Of course it is. You wouldn't find it around here otherwise. Nothing ever seems to praise her. She's not the only one. Sweep the leg. Calm and compose yourself. Sweep the leg. 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 Oh, you fucker! Get up. So we the leg. Here we go. Huge lick dark chain. Yes, and now whoop his ass. All right, lost half its life. I gotta do another chain. Keep sweeping the leg, it keeps falling. Fuck. Sweep the leg! Yes! Oh, you can't even stand up. Every time he stands up, he falls back down. Look! <laughs> Sweep that leg! Oh! Holy shit, what the hell spell was that? Someone swept the leg. Sweep the leg! Sweep it! Sweep! <laughs> He's about to die. Got him! Completely dominated. The Howling Beast Dronduo. Good, the floor will now seal away that miasma. Aha! Go! I think that was actually the easiest demon beast out of all of them because I'm so overleveled. It worked. My asthma is fading. Uh oh. She's hurt. Look, she's limping. It does seem we succeeded and not a moment too soon. Judy, you okay? Did you breathe in some of it? No, I'm fine. I was just wondering why that monster was here. That was a devil's beast, wasn't it? I believe so. One of the monsters that was designed to get stronger every time it fights. We're lucky we met it when this it was miasma sick. If it didn't bit at full strength, yikes. It must have been traveling underground and accidentally burrowed its way here. Stroke of luck to be certain. You may be right, but I can't help but wonder. What if that monster came here to die of its own volition? Huh? Why would it do that? Well, it was designed to do nothing but fight, right? Maybe it got tired of fighting and it thought the miasma could help it die? A noble end for a noble beast. I'm, it's almost poetic. So when we defeated it, its wish came true. I suppose we'll never know what it was thinking. But the idea of being created for an unwanted purpose, desperately battling with its own destiny, it does sound so far-fetched to me.
I guarantee you the sword's not as good as what she has. Nope, look, it's way worse. <laughs> so I'm not, I got the weapon, I'm not even going to equip it. Looks like at one point, it's all linked and out doesn't anymore. See that? Son of a bitch, now we got to manually walk out of here? There's no exit? Oh, come on. There's no exit. Fuck. Shit. Dicks and ass. Ah, that went well. Lately, I felt so intensely focused when I fight. Even I have noticed. You are like a finely crafted sword. A sword, huh? A tool created for the sole purpose of cutting. There is beauty in its simplicity. However, a sharpened blade is surprisingly fragile. And a blade that's too sharp may cut the hand that wields it. <laughs> you too don't have to worry. I am no tool. I understand that in a wise wielder's hands, a sword can be used for more than cutting foes. Indeed. It might be used for maintaining one's mustache. What? Or peeling a potato, perhaps. Uh... And if you swing it sideways, you could use it as a blunt weapon. And if you spin it around the tip, you can use it to punch a hole like a drill. What the you hell are they talking the about? As a weapon to smash someone's joints. Uh, uh, do you think Mila understood what we were getting at? I do believe she understood, but Mila's mindset is a tad on the aggressive side. Can you fast travel out of this cave? I guess maybe I can. the wrong button. Oh, you can fast travel. Cool. Now my question is, is the power back on? Because if the power's back on, I want to kill this uh, last demon beast, but I don't know if the power's back on or not. I guess we're going to find out. Come on, let me... Shut up. I'm glad I interrupted her. Go back then. All right, so let's save up here. Shut up! It's so annoying. She's got worse than Tipo. Aha, look at this thing. Let's check it out. <laughs> 